Puzzle with your friends. You can play puzzles with your friends. Your volume up, dude. I don't know if I want, I'm just gonna blast it. Oh, it's so loud now, I'm so sorry. Puzzle with your friends, $5 on Steam. Probably play puzzles with your friends, let's do it. I need a new profile. I'm gonna be... I like that there's different sound effects. <clears throat> but, that's my name, but... Single player. Can I pick whichever one I want? There's a lot of anime ladies. The heroes in Vitra. Contact artwork for the four heroes you play in Bumblebee's JRPG in Vitra. Are you prepared to go on an adventure? On an adventurous search to find out why a mysterious illness broke out and how to cure it? Sure, I guess. I solved it. I did it. That one is apparently correct. So, you know, good solid puzzle strategy. Just start from the corner. Just, uh, you know, try to, uh... You could apparently cheese this and just do like this. There you go, did it. It's kind of, you know, the hard thing about puzzle games is you could totally just cheat. <laughs> I wonder if this is music from In Vitra. I want to auto hide the music player. Oh no, I don't want to hide the music player. I just want to auto hide it. Okay. Let's continue. So, I don't know if this is like. dark haired girl on the right. Just to my normal, you know, cheater ways. I feel like that looks like it would line up. There's like lines there. There's pixels on my screen. Right, and then this is probably somewhere in here. Probably somewhere down here. I like puzzles. Um, it just seems like really, uh, like there's a lot of pieces. Because it's a puzzle. <laughs> I bet this is like right here. Um, yeah, I've tried to, you know, stray away recently from having, like, things. Um, so I've kind of tried to, like, play some... There's a bunch of iOS puzzle games, actually. And, uh, they're not too dissimilar to this. That's a corner, nice. Hey. Oh, if we can find the ones that just have the name of the game, then we're gonna be solid. It's probably like literally right here. This is her hands. Down here. Oh, this is the top part of her hands. This is Homegirl's face. This is right there. Here. And then I think this is her face, probably right here. Yeah, we're making puzzles. Puzzle game action. Okay, you can apparently play this coop. So, you know. If you've been looking for a puzzle game to really bring you and your friends together, then this could be it. I think it's probably right here. I would totally just, uh, you know. I think it's just somewhere down there. In vitra. 
Cool. It looks like homeboy's belt. Yeah, there is like a tangible quality to it. I wonder what shuffle does. Okay. Wow, that is an intense sound effect. Vitara. Um, it doesn't appear like there's any difficulty scaling. It's just like the initial difficulty of the entire game. So what is this? This is part of her cape or whatever, right? I kind of want to try to find the rest of the pieces that have, like, the name. In them. Oh, this is the It's from Homegirl over here with the belt to hold up her pants. But then, you know, she's just got her entire midsection exposed. Oh, it's the rest of her belt. I got it. Can I zoom in? No. What does the color do? Oh, sick. To help with like the contrast against the puzzle piece background so far, probably. Really dramatic music. I guess I don't really know what I was expecting. Like maybe some upbeat pop tune. <laughs> Hard to. This is his belt. It's not right there. Um. Yeah, I feel like maybe I should try doing one of these in like 1080p to see if you get more room. I'm feeling a little bit cramped. In a way that you know, in a real puzzle, I probably wouldn't be. Uh, squished up this much. Um, I think it's her shirt. Like here somewhere, maybe. I'm totally cheating on these like edge parts, though. I really want to use the shuffle. I think the shuffle's like, okay. Oh, here's the eye. Then this is, this is her face? Totally. I don't think I'm really feeling this music. It's a tad dramatic for my taste. Feels like we're going on a spooky adventure, maybe. In vitra. Okay, so all that's missing is like a corner of the eye part. Uh, it's probably his hand. Is his shirt like in here somewhere? Ding dong. Ding dong. Uh oh sick. Nice, dude. Puzzle action. Doing it. I wonder if there's like a leader. I mean, we're going to find out at the end, right? I've been competing on this like leaderboard time or something. I just don't know it. Um, let's see. So this is probably his. I can't really see where this comes up. 
Oh, it's like on his chest. We found her face. Oh my god, it's happening. Alright, I don't fully know where that goes yet. <clears throat> and this is this is closer up towards the shoulder. Yeah, these hair bits are like Okay. Did it, dude. Um, so I think this is part of the right side of a robe. Oh, right here. Right here, right? Did it. Watching someone solve a puzzle, do a puzzle, probably like mad sketch. I would imagine that there's a lot of appeal, or not a lot of, there's more appeal in watching someone do a real puzzle. <clears throat> you know, I've watched more than one person make Lego on stream, uh, and that wasn't that bad. That was pretty enjoyable. It's like we're kind of close. That legit kind of sounded like my phone alarm, and that kind of freaked me out for a second. So who's got these red pouches? Homegirl. This is the kind of music I was expecting at first. Got it. Dude, it's coming together. We're solving the puzzle. Solve the puzzle. Solve the dream. Mostly done. I feel really good about that. Anime mouth. Oh, I'm 
missing a bottom edge too. Oh, here you go. It's coming together. All the edge is done. Now we just gotta fill in the middle part. Gotta fill in this anime hair. in front of him. This is her. Oh god, I wish I could zoom in on the picture. This is his chest area. lines up is a little bit hard to tell. And then some of these like hand pieces just look like so nothing. side of his like muscly arm. So it goes together like something like that maybe. So the background is mostly in the top so we can kind of try to sort that out a little bit. This is his crossed arm hand thing. Right? Oh, no, no, this is his top left shoulder, I guess. His right shoulder. Huh. 
I'd be keen on seeing some like MLG puzzle solving strats, you know. Yeah, it's weird. For some of these pieces, I feel like I totally have where they are supposed to be. Like some of these in the middle, but because there's no like joining pieces, it can't give it to me. It's like green bit. Right here. Oh, wow. What's oh, her like? She's got tattoos. Yeah, see, like right there, I was totally like dead on with where the piece needed to be. Because where else would it go, I guess? Solve the puzzle, you know. Level up. Fuck yeah. Best time. Black cat. All right, let's do one more. How about, how about that? What do you say about that? Let's do. Uh... Is this just like ads for their other games? <laughs> you know, like I'm feeling it. Which one of these looks harder? I mean, I guess they're all pretty whatever, right? They're all gonna be the same. They're all gonna be puzzles. Map of London. Yeah, these are totally just like concept art for the first. <laughs> if you have, you know, a bunch of assets and you know how to make a puzzle game, just turn your concept art into a puzzle game. Days of Dawn. All right, let's do it. Try to cheat less about that. Okay. If there's a way that I could just be like, hey, like, pull out all the edge pieces. What I'm gonna do. Yeah, there's a lot of green here. This is probably like a. I would immediately describe this as like a slightly more significant challenge than the other. The other level. Not an edge piece. This is like closer to right here. This roads is chill.
accidentally cheated. I'm just gonna find the edge pieces before we do anything else. The name of the game. It's like a their watermark or whatever that is. Giving away some pieces, man. I mean, they're not giving them away. That's just that's the puzzle. Dude, it's like a sinister turn. The music. Jesus, what's happening? found. Right, I'm kind of pushing them up into a place where I can kind of see them better. You're wondering what I'm doing. I also kind of just want to clear this bottom row out so I can... Um, I can put the try to align the bottom pieces a little bit. I feel like in general, you know, I'm probably like putting these into a mess. I'll just reshuffle them after, or maybe not. I don't know. This is generally like decent puddle puzzle strategy, I would say. I don't really know that. So there's co-op in this. I don't really know the format. Like if you trade, like one person goes and then the other person goes. a lot of weirder stuff so you know um yeah i guess one of the things that did come up while i was kind of like going through the catalog of stuff is um and a lot of the stuff that i get sent to play uh, i feel like one of the things that might come up is like would i go out of my way to like get the game if not for like this this like the situation that i'm in and like in some cases like with this i'd probably say i wouldn't go out of my way to buy this myself Kind of weird, you know. There's really more here. That's not it. It's hard to tell. Oh, you know, this is where the different backgrounds would help. I think it's weird because I, I am in a situation where like I wouldn't mind something to specifically try to play while I'm like waiting for cues in Final Fantasy or something like that. That's, that's a lot of the times like a situation where I'm like, yeah, I would, um, you know, be interested in looking for a game to kind of fill that void for me, but. And, you know, this, for its credit, it seems like you could probably, you know, just, like, pause it. I mean, if you don't really care about, like, time too much, then you could just, you know, alt-tab and do your thing. So this is actually probably right here. I'm not going to cheat with that. We almost have enough pieces to... Oh, there you go. Um, you know, and I'm not going to go out of my way to say, like, it would probably be easier to program something like this, but, you know, if you have a lot of... If you're a smaller game development studio and you've got a... Uh, a lot of concept art that you probably don't, you know. I don't know what you do with that stuff other than for like internal use, right? So you can turn it onto something. And 
this is not a bad thing to turn it into. I think th the main other puzzle game that I played on computer is uh, Microsoft has one on Windows 10. It's not that bad, I guess. It's like ad supported though, because it's like free. And this is just a game. Dude, I don't see that edge piece. Dang it. Okay. So now let's sort it into like sky area. Let's try and get the sky stuff done. So I think this is actually part of the waterfall. A lot of this is just like greenery, it's hard to tell like where it actually lines up with anything. That's what makes puzzles like this kind of difficult. I tried to line those up like multiple times and it didn't work. And then just randomly snap right there. It doesn't look like that fits to me. But it does, so obviously. You know, what do you do? So this is like down here. I'm gonna try to get the light blue sky sorted. Okay, apparently those are pieces. Putting all the pieces in a pile on top of each other accidentally links some of them together. That doesn't happen when you play a real puzzle game. Still same thing, I'm just looking for it. Let's see, where is this house? Is it this or here? Still looking for one more edge, too. Yeah, you know, I don't know. Um, if you're looking for a puzzle game, I guess like five dollars for this isn't that bad. Um, you know, nothing will really replace the tangible feeling of making the puzzle by hand. You know, I, I feel like I don't even know, I don't look into a lot of VR games, but I would imagine that even in VR. It's still like a really hard experience to replicate. Um, let's see, so I think this is actually... I'm having a hard time piecing this in my mind. I feel like it's like right here or something. Oh, right there, there you go. Got it. And then this little bush is probably down here. Okay, I don't know where that goes yet. Gotta keep looking for sky. Yeah, this is making me feel like emotional and like not in the right way, I don't think. Like I appreciate the music. But I feel like maybe what I'm, I'm expecting is like some bubbly like pop music. Like, solving puzzles, having a good time, you know? This is like right here. All 
Alright, which one of these houses has these windows? This one. Okay. Uh, I think it's like one of these house bits. Oh, there, got it. Puzzle action, dude, there you go. Yeah, it's kind of funny. You can, like, have a stack of puzzle pieces and accidentally mush them all together. I have a lot of pieces that are pretty put together right now. Well, most of these are, you know what I'm saying? Wow, okay. So now we really just have to do the middle part, which is like kind of going to be difficult. Let's reshuffle. Yeah, and then you get to the, like, the middle part of the puzzle, which is just like kind of a, a blur of color to me. So you're going to have to really whittle it down. Trying to see what like this is. No. Oh. Oh. oh, and then it totally didn't move all these. That's what this pile was. Just pre-put together sections. Or it wasn't pre-put together. I put them together. There you go. I had the right idea with that little block. It's like, I think this is somewhere like right here. I don't have any idea what this is. This is probably some tree stuff. Okay, if that's not right there. Where is there more tree stuff? Oh, right here. There's a, so there's a wheel right here. Why is there a wheel in the picture? I don't... Oh, wait, that's done. Sorry. Wow, I'm dumb. So this is where the water settles, right? Is that water? It's like some streaky bits. And then a door. Oh no, it's stairs, so this is probably... And then this is still like this. Part of the bridge. I 
I'm so distracted by this song because it sounds like my ringtone. I feel like it's not that much easier with the completed pieces because I'm still just like, I don't know where this fits. Get out of here. Okay, I don't know what you are. Playlists. I mean, I guess I could just like load my own music. Just, you know, not for this video. I feel like playing a puzzle game is the ultimate like backseating experience because you're just like. No, 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 put the puzzle piece there. No, no, to the, to the right. And it's like, no, uh, to...
got it. I'll find the place eventually. I like accidentally putting things together. <laughs> it's fun. Yeah, like right there, dude. Come on. Tell me that's not where that goes. I mean, it's obviously not. Hmm. Yeah, like I really wanted to get the um, like one of those bigger Lego um, kits. Like the Millennium Falcon or something like that. It's just so many pieces. And then, you know, I've watched people make it and I'm just like, I don't, it's so big. Like, I don't know what I would do with it after I'm done with it. And you could obviously like put it on display or something like that, but it's like, it'd be so easy to break. All right, there you go. Is there online? Let's see. Puzzle with friends. Wow, it's got different, like, achievement? Hang on. That's it. Um, okay. What does puzzle against friends like? Waiting for second player. Oh. It's only online. Can I do local coop? Nope. What does this bring up? Steam? Okay. Well. Alright, there you go. Let's puzzle with your friends. You can, uh, you know, puzzle, uh, but with your friends. Or just alone. You know, whatever, whatever floats your boat. Are there difficulty options? What is Steam? Oh, is this go to the game? Nice. There you go. Video games figured it out um there's no well, let's check the leaderboard 10 minutes dude nice some like puzzle action master right there where's what is my position a level I think it's supposed to show my position in here or something like that, right? Alright, whatever, it doesn't matter. Um, there you go. Puzzle with your friends. 